Hello everyone, welcome to the lecture. So we'll just start with setting up the Oracle Cloud because we have the Oracle Apex application inside and we can just sign in and set up and host it. Lots of options there and some options are free and some has to be paid. So we'll just set up the free account now and to get started for the new users you can just start for free and try to fill in the details as usual when you're filling a form and you have to provide the credit card information as well just for verification and yeah once you have created and you have to sign in so i don't want to create multiple spam accounts for me i just gonna sign in that directly so i have a account name already that is and i will just go to next and this will move to the oracle cloud infrastructure and you have to set up here as well and i'll provide my username and password here and all these are saved i'm just signing in so once you sign in it will just redirect to the complete cloud environment where you can see all the information here so for our oracle apex setup we have the autonomous transaction processing it's the atp side and there you can uh, create a database it's the autonomous database up to two in number for the free service and yeah and you have limited cpus and storage as well for the free service so here there are two databases which i set up and one is stopped if you didn't use for a long time it will be stopped and here i have the the first one which i created recently so going to here you you will have all the options of this and if you want to create a new database and i can't create it for now if i just create it will show me an error because i can use only up to two so you just have to fill the details here you can give the name and set it to transaction processing and make sure this is always free and so that this will be uh, defaulted to cpu count one and the 200 gp storage so this all and you have to set the password as well so this is the one and let me just go to this uh, database and under this tools you can see there are a lot of applications here in this using this database you can see a skill developer web and the oracle application express which will be working and the other applications so let's open oracle apex and you can see this is the url for this and you have to set up the administrator account for the first time and that will create a workspace as well so for the first users that's just a small process since i have set up the administrator account i can just directly fill this so so you just have to sign in here and with the next lecture we'll just start with setting up the environment